All right, and welcome back. Well, prom dresses, tuxedos, and breathalyzers. That's what some students will see at Missouri High School prom this weekend. For the first time ever, Rock Ridge High School students attending prom will have to take a breathalyzer test before they're allowed inside. Now, a local attorney says that administrators, they threatened to cancel prom if students didn't agree to the test, but the principal says these claims are false and the administration and student council were both in favor of the test. Now, here is the buzz. She made it clear that it, at no time was there ever a threat to cancel prom and a lot of people talking online. Some just saying maybe it's a little bit much for it to be a high school prom, but then there are others that are saying, well, what's the problem? Because yeah. absolutely that could be trouble and see, maybe that can keep folks safe. I see a lot of parents thrilled about that one for sure. Yeah. That's something you worry about. Mm -hmm. What are your kids going to do in their prom night? It's a a lot of pressure on prom night, so. And safety, it's a lot of kids idea. out there, they're driving, some of them, you know, flodging the cars and whatnot, so you yeah. know, you want them you to stay it. safe. Mm -hmm. I love it, yeah, I, you know, at my school, I remember we had uh, prom off campus. Right. And we had a couple, of, and, and this is not involving alcohol, but involving tobacco. Now the event was mm. off campus, and we had a couple of people, seniors who were 18 already, and could legally smoke cigarettes. Mm. I remember they did that at prom, even though it was off campus, got a suspension. So wow, it, even though it's a school, school activity, school but it's a school event. activity. Yeah. So whether it's alcohol, tobacco, if you don't want it, mm -hmm. lay that law down mm -hmm. and kick them out if they can't pass a breathalyzer. We I think that's a great that. idea. All right, we're right back. Parents are happy.